All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Phantom Liberty. I got a call from Mr. Hands about a job out here while I was delivering a car for the captain. I mean, it is weird that I was doing it, like, in the city, and he just called me in the city. Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ. They did shrink the heads of the kids a little bit, which is good. Drama weapon. Damn. It's a nice place. Pretty swanky pad for a media's pocket. Back in my day, the press lived in fucking roach closets. Lock ups both ways. Hmm. What's this? Bonds really, true. dickweed. That looked like a bamboo to you. Kiss my ass. Really likes their plants. See what's here. No. Oh, interesting. Fuck. Scan that. Militech logo 2010s. Cart's gotta be at least 60 years old. Didn't find that in a kabuki bargain bin. Nope. Makes me think. What's this Bree chick up to? We'll see. Hey, you're not Bree. I'm not. What are you doing here? Bree asked me to drop in, pick something up. On my way to see her now. Uh, sure. Sorry. I, uh, heard some noise. I thought maybe Bree was back. Been a while since I've seen her. I'm next door. Thought I should come take a look. Got some dodgy chooms hanging around the building lately. What sort of chooms? Dunno. Definitely don't live in the building. Looked kind of like small town gangoons. N not even. Yeah, just thugs. Gotcha. Thanks, buddy. Just tell Bree to take care of herself here. All right, well. Intent to fast travel, so.
Okay, so we're going down here. Wait, she's... Huh. So she's in the same abandoned building I've been holed up in? Just on a different floor. Look around. I doubt she's coming out with the hidden tennis. here before. Or at least it looks rather similar to where we uh, came through with Myers. Hold it! Hey, Jill! You hired me! Said to meet here! Supposed to come after dark. You get the card? Not another step! This what you wanted? Ah, uh, yes. Sorry, but uh, you know, I can't trust anyone. Scared Great, the give me the card. Me. We'll go inside. Shouldn't remain in plain sight. Here, might have mentioned this was about Militech from the get-go. You even listening to me? Yeah, yeah, let's go. You're being a little dodgy there, Bree. Okay, let's see if this does the trick. Damn. As far as I know, nobody's been here in the last decade. And the systems date back to 2013. Fingers crossed. <sighs> We're in. Some of the security measures might still be active, so you go first. No, not going anywhere till you explain a few things. Oh, didn't think I was paying you to ask questions, but okay. What do you want to know so badly? What do you plan to find down here, exactly? Well, if the files I borrowed from Militech are up to date, the lab inside's teeming with secrets. I plan to learn them. Knew Media once. He liked to dig up Megacorp dirt too. Tried to expose some veterans aid scam, a glorified corp PR campaign. Max Jones, WNS. Any buzzers buzzing? WNS buzzer is. Don't know the man, but I envy him his job. Think his position's vacant now. What? Report didn't generate waves. Max dropped it. I forced him to. Corp would have zeroed him for it. I see. Truly motivating tale, that. 
Thanks for sharing. Now go in, see if it's safe. Got turrets, but they're offline. Come on in. Two doors. Shit. Card's not working. Hang on. Let me see if there's another route. This feels like a trap. This way. Let's go. We've been lucky so far, but watch out. Can't know what these old systems will do. Actually, turrets like these operate in sequential circuits. Hacking one triggers a feedback loop that boots up others. So don't hack any of them. Go in. Your face! Standard in Take him out! Clear now. Well, at least we know the security. Mercs first. Comp looks brand new. Just this one. Told you. A Militech research expedition came here a few years back. I probably left it behind. Come on! We don't have time! Oh, hold on. Holy shit!
do it. Phew. We're almost there. We don't can't have bad luck all the time. We made it. The mainframe. The host. Unbelievable. There's even files from the third corporate war here. Yeah. Militech was tap dancing on its tits trying to keep Sokka from pushing them off the stage. <sighs> Shit. The oldest ones are encrypted. But wait. There's some newer footage. Dated 2068. Must be when they came back. Come here. Take a look. Yeah. Okay, it's recording. Senior Research Specialist Evan McCray, this is day three of our expedition. We've moved some equipment to the bunker. The old rail system remains largely functional. They might have used it to transport heat exchangers from the lab once upon a time. There is a mountain of old research here. I'll see if we can find a use for any of it. The bastards were trying to reopen the project. Well, Caesar managed to breach one of the data forts. He found fragments of some outdated code. Command controls for a weapon, perhaps? All we need now is an AI to merge its findings. Lisa will probe the black wall for any potential gateways. Huh? Right, uh, uh, day 39. Thanks, thanks, Lisa. Hear that? They wanted to breach the Black Wall. Day 50, 5 0. We received orders from HQ to shut down and return home. Uh, they say we're not safe here anymore. Caesar's packed us. We await Lisa's return. Poor thing's been in the bunker for two days. Jacked in. Or is it three? She... She just won't come out. She's trying to download the data from the fortresses, but... but we can't have to take it with us if she does. Now that's it. I'm gonna get her, Caesar. Shit! This is bigger than I thought. Militech using some rogue AI to augment their old weaponry? This is huge. Yeah. Militech and some secret weapon. Street's been saying it for ages. Usually between worlds ending on Tuesday and Bart Moss is hibernating in a fridge. Look, if it mattered, would have been old news years ago. Kidding me? You hear about Soul Killer? Now imagine a similar project, only Militech's pushing the buttons. These things change the world. And not for the better. At least not for people like us. Like other peeps haven't tried to contact Blackwall AIs. Failing to see the big break there. Look, Voodoo Boy's poking at the Blackwall is one thing, but one of the world's most powerful megacorps weaponizing a wild AI? Infinitely worse. When people learn Netwatch is busy hunting ordinary Joes while giving the megacorps free reign, imagine the outcry. So we got it. Grab what you need. Let's Delta. Dante! What the? Howdy, Bree. He's me once, won't do it again. Who the hell are you? Really? Dante Caruso. Militech Special Agent. Stand down. 
I'm here for Bree. Couldn't give half a shit about you. Knew she was hiding somewhere in the area. Knew you were looking for her. Just had to watch and wait. Thanks, kid. Hope you're not about to start defending her. Must have filled your head with all sorts of horse shit. Bree can talk. Ask her yourself. And what'll I hear? More lies? Spinning tall tales is her specialty. She tell you how she wrote articles for us mucking up the competition? Ah. Can see those gears churning now. Yeah. Bree worked for Militech. That true? Yes. Took the gigs because that meant I got access to their archives. You gotta believe me. He knows I'm close. He wants to stop me. Another failure to communicate. You don't know my mind, but I sure as hell know yours, Bree. A flag in the wind's what you are. Whose pocket are you in right now? Arasaka? Netwatch? That quant you were pulling intel from. Caesar Maharez. You know they zeroed him, right? What are you talking about? Bree's just in it for the cred. Thing is, cause of her, they'll wipe anyone who touched the project. Including you. You want that? He's just trying to scare us, V. You know that. Sorry, Bree. Stop him, V! Lab ain't big enough for the both of us. Come on, just zero him! Think. You really want to stick your neck out? Come on out. Thanks, V. I mean it. What are you saying? Any truth to it? Really? The man who just tried to kill us, you give a damn what he thinks. <sighs> yeah, I wrote some pulp garbage sponsored articles. Rent doesn't pay itself. Thing is, at some point you wake up, and you realize you live in a dump and your life's a waste. And, well, I did it. Changed my life. Didn't know I had it in me, but here I am. That's good. Know how you feel. Also left the corp behind. Wasn't easy, but it gets better. I promise. Yeah, counting on it. Anyway, I'll finally be working for number one. Think I'll take a long vacation first, though. You know, in case some suit decides to trail me again. Absolutely, yeah. Really helped me out, V. Get the fuck out of here. You go ahead. I'll grab the rest of the files myself. I just stole her gun. <laughs> I mean, puss comes to shove, she can live down here. She'd have to surface for some food, but... house for a sec. I'm gonna take a look at these new guns. 
revolver. And a, what, a new? Briefly, V. Netwatch has dispatched a hunter. As the quarry, exercise caution. See what? Bree Whitney sold the Militech's data, then disappeared. Netwatch is now out to wipe anyone who came close to it. Occupational hazard. Take care of yourself, V. Okay. Shit. <sighs> Fucking hazed me. Great. Lovely. I'm being hunted by Netwatch right now. <laughs> Here somewhere that I can go directly in. Uh. Been here before, it's exactly like then. Remember last time we had this convo? I do. And yes, the rules is. V's here! Hey! It's about time, too. Nearly done finalizing the plan. Back on the same page, are we? Not exactly. Brings back a lot of memories, all this. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. What happened in Medellin? What was the up there? We had our sides trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's... a long story. Think we can spare 60 seconds? Hell, might even learn something about So Me that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aimed to plant our own essay in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She 
She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to Walkie's dopamine. Spending big money on Kit's luxury was kind of his M.O. So what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, who's a good boy? Then she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. Worked out though, right? We're all here now, together. Hmm, which can't be said for Hernandez and his men. We took any possibility of that from them. All thought of subterfuge went poof. We had to kick the door down. A rival cartel wiped them out. That was the official version. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. That's fucking crazy. I mean, it like that. That's something you would never figure out unless you see it happen. Copied every bit of somebody's likeness and personality, but their fear of dogs just. Mm -mm. Especially with them being so fucking rare in, in Cyberpunk. We've parsed the intel from the shard Somi gave. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Stop worrying, Reed. We'll get her out. Save her. I know. And not just her. Ladder goes for you, too. Right. Our objective. To free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue op. Because... Well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Mines. Not about a pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, I'm gonna kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Asaka soul killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right. Plan. I'm here. Hanson and me with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hanson access codes, handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hanson's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now, we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Hey, Marik and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand. Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, because they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental wide in NC. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. 
before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. And your role in all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil wrap. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hansen? Right. Where well, you'll sell him the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goods. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the anywhere. And Songbird. We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much as hell. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Okay. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talked about nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute. You know Reed better than I do. What he thinks? What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. <laughs> and so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will. Is that right? It's not wrong. So, we serve Hansen up on a silver platter. It'll be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways. We're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. And any for your thoughts, Alex? About all this? <sighs> Honestly? Still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep. Saddled you with the Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something. Like, the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. Stations. How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. Find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agency's got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So breach the station, trace the car. Good, what then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno, when anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there.
Suck it up. This is FIA Trunk Ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. All right, Todd Howard. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. Sounds good. Is that it? Okay. Nothing. Where, where, where was that door that I came in at? Oh, that's right. Okay. chapel. talk long, but two things, quickly. First, good news. I managed to upgrade your relics firmware. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Don't worry. Completely painless. Relic upgraded? How'd you manage it? No easy feat, I guess. Tweaking tech that advanced. Mm, let's say I've had extra time on my hands. More than I expected. Don't worry. We're getting you out of there. I know. First, good news, you said. So there a second thing? Right. It's super important. It stays between us. It's gotta. Okay. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, need to Delta. But see you soon. Great. Just great. I ain't got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Alright, thank you. Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed soon as you grab that encryption key. Yep. How far is that? 700 meters in the opposite direction. We can hit her there and then go about getting the rest of the encryption.
Sure we're alone? Wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. It means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. Okay. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in Enciana Simon. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. And swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it, every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn, actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scop dogs around. He shit talking one of his chews. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yearning in to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you missed something, it's usually too late. Songbird, need you to be straight with me. I... I helped Hansen spring the trap on Myers. My end of the deal, in exchange for the neural matrix. I down the plane, deliver Myers, yes. But blast her out of the sky, then hunt her down? Wasn't what we agreed. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself, too, almost. Ground the plane. That was a plan. Didn't expect he'd... blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. It fucked everything up, I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Wasn't any other way, honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. weapons and tools, they don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Sounds 
Sounds painfully familiar. I think I know how you feel. I doubt anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. The one to ask, actually. What happens exactly, you know, when you reach past the black wall? Know the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. I mean, losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. But it feels horrible. Delta 2 with the Chimera. Like a living nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk. So he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Join and serve, or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence. Yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah, with you and myself. I need to get away from Kurt, then USA, Reed, from everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hanson as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Wire's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk one at that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City is just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? It'd be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission. Grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then. Uh. You helped me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... That's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. 
Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Can't be both. You fit right in in DC. Just enough truth, but not too much. I'll take what I can get. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hanson. Ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, thanks so very much for joining me. When we return, we will uh, call Reed, access those points, and do all that. But until then, I thank so very much. If you're on YouTube, please like and subscribe. Just drop me a follow if you haven't already, and I'll be back in a moment.